Hey guys, this is Joe from Manchester Music Mill, and I'm here with Dave Newsom, a uh, professor at Berkeley College of Music and UNH. We're, we have a uh, special guitar that we'd like to uh, introduce and demo that we acquired from the first and only owner. It is a 1966 Jose Ramirez Class 1A, uh, the Segovia model. There's a misconception about uh, what 1A means. Uh, that is not the model. This is a, uh, it's, a it's the class. It's the, um, the highest class that Ramirez made um, by the top master luthiers. Uh, the class is 1A, and this is a rare model that was um, designed by Jose Ramirez III uh, to suit uh, Andres Segovia's um, needs uh, and requests. This is a larger scale than a traditional classical instrument and um, it has the projection like no other uh, classical that uh, I've ever had in the store. So we just wanted to uh, highlight it and, uh, and, and give it a little bit of special uh, attention and uh, we think that you're going to love it and uh, we want to find a good home for it and uh, we're happy to take trades and uh, make any deals work. Uh, this is truly a special guitar and uh, we want to uh, find it a great home. Uh, a little bit about the, the purchase. Uh, the original owner uh, was a classical study of uh, Michael Lorimer who was a direct understudy of uh, Segovia and he went to um, Segovia's performances, uh, had all the books directly uh, recommended by Segovia. Uh, there's some transcriptions from Segovia in all the paperwork that we have uh, from the 60s. Uh, we, we have all the paperwork directly from the Ramirez family uh, from the original purchase to the, the shipping overseas. Uh, the family went to Spain to order this guitar for their son who, who owned the guitar um, who is now uh, retiring. So, um, so one owner, uh, excellent condition, and it's been completely restored. Uh, I had uh, the top, top luthier uh, that works on classical uh, guitars um, take this and bring it back to factory spec. It is, uh, it's been fully re refretted and the fingerboard has been planed and uh, it plays uh, better than it did when it came out of the factory based on uh, today's uh, requirements. And uh, so we're excited to highlight it and uh, I'll give it off to uh, Dave Newsom.
Thanks, Joe. Thanks for letting me try out this amazing instrument. Uh, as Joe said, there's so much history involved in this particular instrument, um, but I just want to talk a little bit to the amazing qualities that are uh, within this. Um, as you can see, it's amazingly constructed, uh, beautiful Brazilian rosewood back and sides, um, but this cedar top, this Spanish cedar top, is just amazing. The grain is so even and uh, refined uh, that it really just produces such an incredibly loud but balanced and, and beautiful tone. So I've been fortunate just to have the guitar for a few days and just to hear it open up and uh, the, the incredible range of dynamics and colors that you can produce on this, uh, it's just really kind of breathtaking. Um, I'll give you an example um, of just some of the power that this instrument really possesses. But then you contrast that with just how full and brilliant it sounds when you do some of the more subtle uh, lower dynamics or even harmonics. So it's just got the full range of power and brilliance. Or just in incredible beauty and, and nuance to it as well. So I highly recommend you come down to Manchester Music Mill and uh, try to get your hands on this instrument to try it out. Um, or reach out to Joe on the website uh, to inquire about this amazing instrument and uh, you know, making this the real prize of your guitar collection. I, I can't say enough about the instrument, um, the history, um, the brilliance of the, the, the tone whether you're a collector or uh, looking for uh, the highest quality concert instrument, I think this 1966 Ramirez is the guitar for you. And thanks, Joe. You did say something about trades, right? <laughs> Thank you. Yeah. <laughs>